Okay, I'm Mr. Hammington and uh, this is the Geography Department. I'm the Head of Geography and I've been teaching at the Priory for a very long time, over 20 years now. And I'm Miss Buckland, also a Geography teacher, and I've been at the Priory School for around seven years now. Um, we are very fortunate because we are able to run a significant number of field trips uh, locally to the school. We're able to take students to Box Hill and also to Denby's Vineyard. Uh, we also run trips to the Olympic Park in Stratford. Uh, we've also taken students down to Dorset to study the coastline, uh, to Portsmouth to study the cityscape. Uh, and we also do A-level residential trips. Uh, we've been to Wales for a week, we've been to Devon for a week, we've run overseas trips to both Iceland and Uganda so we really enjoy taking students out of the school and trying to bring the subject to life. And I would say we also pride ourselves on making sure our lessons are topical, we always use and make relevant links to things in the news uh, and try and be as creative as possible and get kids engaged in, in doing things in the lesson that excite them and interest them. Uh, as geography is such a fantastic subject, subject to teach. Um, I really like teaching the Priory because uh, the school is small, it's got a community uh, atmosphere uh, and uh, we work very hard to have a fantastic relationship with our students uh, and that makes it a great place to come uh, and work. Uh, also I'm lucky enough to teach with some fantastic colleagues uh, and uh, we've got a strong staff team uh, which of course really helps coming to work and doing the job of teaching. Uh, I think one of the most rewarding things uh, in this job is following a student through their time at school. Um, we've just had uh, one of our amazing students, Lauren, who uh, started here in Year 7. Uh, she loved her geography and she came and studied with us at A-level uh, and she's now off to Cambridge University to pursue a geography degree there. And obviously we're really thrilled to see uh, someone's journey from a, a shy Year 7 through to someone off to Cambridge University. And we've got many students of stories uh, or stories of students, I should say, who've gone on to do amazing and exciting things uh, both locally and around the world and it's always fantastic to, to see that journey from a young person to uh, an adult in the real world. Yeah, there are so many rewarding things uh, on a day-to-day -day basis, but I'd say uh, one of the best things about teaching geography is knowing when a kid has sort of taken it to their learning and actually used it to make a difference in their community. So, for example, at school we've had the eco set up uh, and some Year 7s uh, last year have, have really worked well on that and have been very passionate about you know, helping to promote um, our, you know, the environment and everyone's well-being in school. So I think kids really like uh, being creative in lessons and we always encourage them to you know, use their other learning and other subjects to create projects. Um, so for example, the Denby's projects, we've had some amazing uh, work created. We've had you know, animations being done using computer technology. We've had some incredible models, uh, some that were cakes as well, which I enjoyed a lot, um, and uh, many more. So I think the, the creativity that, that kids get out of the subject and sort of finding connections and links to their, to their other interests and other subjects uh, I think it's one of the most enjoyable things. I think um, as well that uh, we try and engender into our students uh, a sense of caring and understanding the world they're growing up in and of course uh, our planet is the most amazing ball of rock but it's also uh, faces so many challenges and we always try and I guess link our teaching to uh, the world that young people find themselves growing up in which can be confusing and challenging uh, and it's really enjoyable I guess to take students on the journey of uh, to, to a greater understanding of, of uh, the planet and uh, the problems that it faces. Um, it might surprise you to know that uh, I, as well as a teacher here, I'm a parent here. Um, all three of my children come to the school and um, my oldest son is uh, studying his a at the moment, uh, my daughter is doing her GCSEs and my youngest son is in Key Stage 3. And I think as a parent, why do we uh, choose to send our children here? Um, I think our children really liked the uh, small nature of the school, uh, the friendly uh, atmosphere around the school uh, and the fact that uh, each student is known individually and that helps uh, individuals I think make fantastic progress in their time here uh, and my children have really enjoyed coming to the school, there's no hiding that.